in terms of biochemistry. It's telling them that your skin is a fossil little bile layer, and then the hydrocarbon burns <coughs> to the uh, highest temperature at the tip of the flame, and when you move it, well, the water forms a film, and that is the living fossil. Or explaining to them that uh, potassium and water react to liberate or hydrogen and the exothermic reaction causes a fire and things like that. So we put it in very, very simple terms into the language that a common man can understand. And a common man is fascinated with that. I've seen done these programs even at central research institutes and people have shown a lot of interest in that. Basically, man has a fascination for magic and it's exotic. And we use that to project scientific expression. There's, a, there's obviously a, a, a use for this, this approach in the West as well. Uh, I'm sure you know Darren Brown. Yeah, I'm not. Uh, he recently made a wonderful little piece where he went to America uh, posing as a person with special powers and try to get different heads of different movements to endorse him. And they did so without a single skeptical question. Um, so, yeah, we, we could use this here as well. I just couldn't do that myself because I'm too well known for it. But we <laughs> could try that. And actually, I used to go to such places to see what they were doing, but now obviously I can't go because I'm in the market for the hunting if I do that. And I obviously can't go to these places unless I tell the authorities in that place that I am going there. Because they, if anything happens, they'll make such a big fuss about it and say, you never told us that you're coming. And obviously when I'm coming, they'll send the police and some uh, person from the administration will be there. And that will cause more problems for me than uh, any advantage. Because once the police come and once these people come, once I had two truck bus loads of police guarding me when we went to expose a miracle of lamps burning without any oil in a place near Magnolia, about 200, 300 kilometers. And there were a thousand people from the village waiting to attack me. And there were these cops with guns trying to protect me. And there were 30 TV cameras trying to uh, film what was happening. So that's what happened. Yeah, uh, thank you for that show. Actually, it has reminded me um, um, an Odian pastor who was in Uganda. Yeah, me, I'm sorry. But he was in Uganda in 2010 and he was tying uh, an, uh, an electronic gadget around his arm. So whenever he could do <laughs> raise his arm like this, whoever had a metal oil and a, uh, maybe <laughs> earring or what, could be shocked by the whole speech and <laughs> the whole church could fall. All people were falling <laughs> down, but they were being actually it was Benny by Hinn. that. Uh, was it Benny Hinn? No, it is a Nigerian pastor. I think he had a Yeah, I'm not sure, sure. It was in the campus. Benny is another. So these people would uh, mind using any of the fruits of science, the modern technology, but their attitude is in the 16th century. That is the tragedy of India, who, who have a population with a mindset in the 16th century, with the technology of the 21st century available. The Godman will come in his several groups and then he'll have a black very in his pocket. Whereas we science, science activists, the latest gadget in our pocket will be a ball point. Right? Mm -hmm. uh, is the technological progress in India that we hear about in the U.S. Bangalore, places where they have lots of high technology and evidently educated people from good technical universities. Please Is that helping don't change? say educated people. Okay. Say literate people. Because <laughs> one may be literate in engineering, but not educated. Yeah. But, but is that, is that in, in your opinion, going to help uh, slowly but surely as technology grows in India and people use more and more technology in their lives and whatnot? 
to uh, dispel a lot of the, the uh, magic and mysticism, uh, or do you think it's so well, deep? That's what we great. were hoping that it would do it, but yeah. actually it's deeply. Ah. Because if a man in the northernmost part of India sat and did a miracle uh, with the old technology of 200 years back, it would take 10 years for that news to come to the southernmost part. But now it is done in 10 minutes. So, and there are gullible people in this old primitive mind say, oh yes, we saw the Baba on TV. Mm -hmm. I got an SMS from that. And actually, in 1995, I do not know whether anybody can recall, the idol started drinking milk in India, that of Ganapati. And at that time, the news spread through telephone network and the mobiles. And I was the only person in the world who was attacked and who was injured because uh, during that episode. Because somebody threw stones at me and I got some head injuries because of that. Because I was telling people it's not a miracle but it's only surface tension. And the BBC made a documentary about it, and it but it was not shown me. And in that documentary, I played myself. Because people had made a street play in which somebody used to play my, me being thrown, attacked and all. But when BBC came to shoot that particular documentary, those troops invited me and they asked me to play myself. Anyway, uh, we have the other part of it, the right-wingers, the Hindu right-wingers who are sitting in the comfort of Europe and America and all the developed nations. And Sitting there, they are talking about the greatness of Indian civilization and our Rishi Munis who have been sitting and doing. I said, why don't you come back and enjoy that? They all said, obviously wouldn't. They would like to sit here, enjoy all the fruits of the technology and science, and at the same time, talk about the greatness of our ancient, wonderful civilization, which I don't think it somebody trying to kill somebody with a thought or anything. Oh, and it, and it incidents that happen to all of us. Yeah. But only one person is being projected uh, who supposedly have done it, but we have all done it so many times. It happened to me once in Kerala about 10 years back. That one guy tried to kill me by his magical powers and nothing happened. He was a psychiatric patient. <laughs> he was fully Yes, lots of these things happen. But it's a question of how you publicize it. Uh, when something happens on a channel, you also should feel the need to publicize it, and then it becomes not, not many in India, but outside. 